I got a package today, and I already opened it because I wasn't sure what it was. Because I was pretty sure I only bought one of these. It was bidding. I did good on these. 99 cents. I thought I was getting one random one. But I got three, which means I only paid 33 cents a piece. And we're going to look at these. These are LQLs. All these LQLs are made by different people, different companies. They just take the doll and they... Okay, it's hard to squeeze out this one. And I do believe that they will be spitters because most of the folks that actually do anything seem to be spitters. Do they stand? Oh, wow. I, I think they put them in the package not dry. They weren't dry when they put them in the package, which is why... Oh, she can't... Why? She's got orange all over her face because she was wet, went like that, and then it got on her. So, it got on her because they put her in the package wet. That is weird. This one doesn't have any problem. Oh my god, it is so hard. I don't even know if this one will take on any water. I'm going to get some water and then we will see what they do. Doesn't, this one doesn't work at all. Oh, they, they don't, oh my gosh. No, I mean, maybe the air's coming through there. I don't know. Take on the water. The bodies are hard molded plastic, so they will not move like the actual L, OL dolls. No. It's coming out the neck. So no, these do not spit or cry. None of them do because the water's actually coming out the neck. Now, if you put a pinhole in the mouth, I think you could get it to take on water through the mouth and spit. A lot of work. So these are not actually functional at all. Um, they're cute. They stand. They're not as good looking as some of the other fakes that I have. Most of the other fakes that I've gotten in the past have not been squishy heads. But if you get the squishy head, they should make it so they can take on water. Because I bought these and bit on them because it says spit, wise and spit, cries, and whatever. But they don't. They don't. They don't. They don't do it. So, okay. This one, I have the baby real version of her that I got from, I think it was Fantasy Princess. It might have been Adulting with Children. Shout out to them. I won their giveaways in the past. Um, these are the worst of the squishy heads I've gotten. Um, the body is the same, and it's nice that they all seem to stand. And they do have this little thing right there so that you can put them on play sets. That's actually a nice addition. For, because of the fact that they won't be able to stand. Again, they didn't come in a ball. But, I mean, they actually stand pretty well, except for that one, compared to the other fakes. So, I mean, there's that. Um, a lot of times, if they are not standing at this part, you just need to file down the extra pieces, and then they'll maybe stand. So, put it in wet. Do not actually do anything. Um, hard body. So I wouldn't suggest if you see these on the internet and you just want an LOL doll and you can't afford it, I wouldn't suggest these, especially not for your children. For making videos, that's fine. It's fine to make videos with stuff like this, but you're not playing with it all the time. I will eventually repaint these and see how they look. And they're different sizes. I think LOLs are supposed to all be the same size. I don't think these are. Now, what the names are, I don't quite remember hers. And this is the first time I've gotten these type of molds. And yes, there's yellow on her, so she was put in wet as well. I like the hair on this. And again, when they make the cheap ones, they do it so cheap that coming out of the mold, they look like this. So maybe I could file that down, I don't know. So yes, these are the worst quality squishy head, um, 
little LOL fakes that I've gotten. I'm going to go through the pros and cons. They were cheap. They were uh, 99 cents for all three of them, 33 cents for the whole lot. Um, the pros, they have squishy heads. You could rework them to make them spitters at least. They will take on water, but they won't expel it. Um, they're cute. They stand pretty well for the most part, except for this one. And... They don't smell very bad for the type of fix that they are. The hard plastic smells a little, but the rubber doesn't, this soft plastic part does not smell bad at all. It actually smells kind of pleasant. Now that are the pros. Here are the cons. This part. This part is terrible. Um, they don't, they don't spit or cry. Um, they were put in the package wet. Um, they don't move because they're hard plastic and they didn't come with any bottles or anything else. Even my hard plastic um, babies came with hard bottles, but these did not. Um, and because they're fakes, you don't know what they're made out of. They could be made out of dangerous materials. These probably aren't that dangerous just because they don't smell very bad, but they had paint all over them and that's a hassle to fix. So, write in the comments whether you think these were worth it or not. Have a good day. Bye!